Hey y'all, how's it going? I am Joy. Welcome back once again to the Game of Life 2. This will be our second video, and I'm very proud of myself. I did not play this at all since I recorded the last one. So everything is as it was. I am one tile away from unlocking the other car, and one tile away from unlocking the um, next outfit thing. I gotta buy two houses. My luck on getting houses is not that great in this, so oh, that's gonna be a problem. And then this one is just to collect some love, which I'm totally fine with doing. So without any further ado, let's head into Classic World once again and see if we can unlock this gosh darn car, because I really wanna see what the final vehicle is. And I've been keeping myself away from this game until today. So let's get into this thing and see what else this game has in store for us. Okay, so for this one, I think I want to be the anti-joy. And I'm going to go through this with no love. It's going to be very difficult for me. But, that is what I want to do. Where's my blue? Can I get a good blue? Eh, I mean that's not a bad blue. All right, you have the same car as I do, Alice. Go away. Uh, you can be this one. All right, we're perfectly represented. Female, male, that. All right. So anyway, as I was saying, since we want to try to get my um, other unlockables done, I'm going to go through this. I'm going to go through life. Never knowing love. Or at least try to. In my experience, that has not exactly gone to plan, but we'll see how it goes. Yay! I think this is going to be like a Scrooge kind of run, maybe. It's lawn day, so my apologies in advance if you hear the tractor outside. <sighs> Alright, anyway, so knowledge and greed. I am going for wealth tokens. That's my goal, anyway. We'll see if this serves me any better. Um... I don't want to spend... This is my plan. I'm not going to spend money unless I absolutely have to. Uh, I don't really care which one of you I do Rochambeau with. I'm probably going to lose anyway. Oh, maybe not. That's a good number. Yeah, alright. I'll take your money. Thank you. Yay! Ooh, achievement progress. Cool. I'm still disappointed that you can't seem to have like a well-rounded life in this and be successful. Like you have to almost focus on one one style or another. It makes me sad, you know, cuz I'm I'm of the mindset of having a balanced life. Knowledge is very important, but so is love and life Life without love is not a life I want to live anymore. N now that I've experienced it and I've, I've witnessed it, it makes life so much better, you know? And of course I've had it with, you know, family ties and all that, but it's so much different to have a, a chosen love, whether you can control <laughs> the choice or not. Sometimes, uh... Sometimes your brain just comes up with stuff and you don't mean to be here, but you are, you know? Ooh, yay, money. Yay, more money. So far this is working out okay. I still have no tokens to my name, but I do have money. That's always a plus. Oh, 
Oh, revenge. Sorry, I'll take that money back. Again. I'm sorry, Ruby. Why am I apologizing to the bot? I'm supposed to be the anti-joy. Supposed to be a, a ruthless Scrooge McDuck. McBird. I just channel my inner Dino and be mad at everything. Err, fate wheels, I hate these. Grr. Grr. See? And I hate these wheels. At least it was only 60. Wait, hold up, hold up. My salary is 70k and my taxes are 60? This is some bull. That's not even a high tax bracket. What are you doing? Okay. Okay. I, I see how it is, life. I, I get it. I need another job. 100% need a new job. This ain't good. I don't even know you, Josh. Why would I give you 20k for a wedding gift? I don't even know you. There you go. Good choice. Retro video games. Investing for the future. Of course you get a promotion. I might have to just hope that I can get the wealth crown. Because there's no way I'm catching the others. Absolutely no way. Taxes. You see what being a greedy Scrooge gets you? That's two tax payments back to back. That is almost my entire salary. This is bull. Absolute malarkey. Good. Pay your taxes. Dumb. Alright, so, if you guys have this game, what is your usual strategy? Are you like me and you try to be more well-rounded, or do you tend to focus more on the uh, wealth aspect, where you're investing in your future, houses, and the like, or are you more of a family kind of player? I don't know, I mean, there are perks to... Oh, right between the two houses. How dare you? Um, I mean, I could sell a bunch of other people's stuff and get money for it. Right? That's that's how that works, right? I'm gonna watch a documentary. I, I'm not a fan of garage sales. I know that a lot of women are. Like, a lot of women love shopping. Oh my god. I don't. I don't, I don't like shopping, I don't like spending money, I don't like crowds, I barely like people. So. I do like buying things, I guess, in, in some regard, because I mean, you need stuff to survive, of course, but like extra stuff, frivolous stuff, I'm, I'm just not a fan of spending money for no reason, you know? Like, why? I swear to God, if you land on taxes again, I'm very upset with you. Alright, what am I doing? Online course. I need a better job. So, in this regard, I have to spend money. I have to. I don't want to. But sometimes it's necessary. I... This has a lot less in the way of taxes. And I'm already winning in the money department, am I not? Yeah, I've got almost double what they have in the money, and she has loans. So, I'm gonna... 
I'm just gonna lower my tax bracket, which is weird because you'd think that film director and athlete would be like in the same, whatever. Anyway, I'm just gonna stick with the same amount of money and a lower tax. And we'll see how we go from there. Oh, could have gotten a raise already. Unfortunate. Um, I'm staying away from love. So I'm just gonna sell a vintage spoon. A vintage spork would be so much better. I mean, 20k for a spoon spork thing is not a bad payday at all. So I will take that. Why would you want to upgrade your job? You're a chef. Oh, that's why. See, I had to go with the other one. Taxes are so much lower. At least you didn't get the big one. That's good. Alright, let's go. See what else life has in store, I guess. Yay, pay myself. Up over a mil. I'll take that. Ooh, do I play it risky? I've been burned by taxes enough. I'm gonna go the safe route. Ah, uh, really a one? A one? We landed on a one. Ugh. Oh, but it's an alpaca, though. This is going to cost me money, and that's an alpaca. And I can still be solitary with an alpaca. Maybe this will be the start of an alpaca farm that I can have a business of, which will give me more money. Give me an alpaca. I love alpacas. Have you guys ever seen that, um, that video or that meme or whatever of the angry alpaca in the back of a car? Somebody uh, honked because they were like stuck in traffic and people are dumb like that. So they honked. And this angry alpaca stuck his head out the window, turned around, and was all like, How dare you make noise? It was one of the most adorable things I have seen in a long time. And this was a while ago, so it's still one of the most adorable things. Oh, my OCD is so happy. I have a million even. I am so happy. Unfortunately, that's going to change. Why is a scrapbook giving you a wealth token instead of a happiness token? Can, can you sell the scrapbook for money? Or is it a, a wealth of experience? Because you'd think that that would go in happiness, since it's literally... Your memories. I, I don't know. There's a lot of things about this game that's kind of strange to me, but... I do enjoy it a lot. One of my favorite games that I've played recently. I still need to play Clue. I believe that's next up on my docket. In other uh, channel-related news, I've been working on a special Pokemon project. Uh, a couple of them, actually, but one of them is a little bit more advanced uh, as far as editing goes. So I'm very, very excited to see what you guys have to say about that and if you want that kind of thing going forward, because I enjoy doing it. It's just... It's a little more intensive than I thought it was, and I'm uh, not exactly the best of editors. So it's probably going to be cringy. I know that going in. But I'm, I'm enjoying the process. It's been, it's been fun learning all the keyframes and like timing of the audio and all that, because I'm, I'm not going to spoil what I'm doing, but uh, let's just say that I'm not alone in it. So maybe that'll give you guys a little bit of a clue as to what's going on. But... <clears throat> Why wouldn't you repay your loan so you don't have to pay them back at the end of the... See, that's just fiscally irresponsible. You have the chance to pay off your loans at a lower rate and you chose not to. That's just irresponsible, Ruby. What is wrong with you? Can I please stop rolling ones? 
Or spinning, I guess. Spinning ones. Just, just slowly, inch by inch, making my way across the board. Um, I don't want anyone else to have money, so I'm just gonna play the lottery. That's fine. That's fine. Nobody else got money off of me, so we're good. I will take that. And I will speed this up because I ain't got time for you, Josh. I got things to do. <sighs> like, mow the lawn. <laughs> Eventually. Do I still not have any tokens? I think the only token I have is one knowledge token. I have two knowledge tokens. Oh yeah, and my alpaca love. That's right. A, a six. At least it wasn't a one. It's another freaking action card, but I'll take it. I don't have a family. Me and the alpaca are gonna watch a movie. What would we watch? Leave that in the comments below. What would be the best movie, preferably animated, to watch with your pet alpaca? Emperor's New Groove? He turns into a llama type thing, right? I think. I've been watching a lot of Beegers lately. Um, almost daily, actually. I've, I've been watching something of his. Be it his... Um, collaborations with uh, Caleb, Arsenal, MC. You should subscribe to both of them if you're not. I believe Dad just hit the house. That's awesome. Cool. I will go and fix the deck later. Life is fun. Both the game and in reality. <sighs> anyway. I've been watching a lot of Beegers and he's been doing like these weird, like, crazy voices are trying to, anyway. I, I personally love his voice acting. He doesn't seem to like it, but I certainly do. It is so much fun. He puts so much time and effort into it. And he recently hit uh, 1K subscribers. Finally. I'm so happy. Now we need to get him monetized. So I've been watching a lot of his content back. Um, I have an account that I, I watch people, uh, I, I binge watch people on my other account. So I subscribed to him with that one, and I've been binging a lot. Was I first? Yeah, I came first. Heck yeah. Don't turn that, troll. Or whomever you're gonna be. Um, I'm just gonna, I guess, YOLO it, because uh, bucket lists are for chumps, apparently. I'm just gonna take my money. This entire run has been nothing but money. I may as well finish it with money. Now, can I please land on black? I haven't really landed on black much this entire time, so... No, I can't. That's fine. At least I get something. You know, with the bucket list, if you land on red, you get nothing. And with my pension for never hitting black, apparently... Pension is the right way to go. What was I saying? Right. Beegers. Emperor's New Groove. He does a lot of, like, cartoon type of voices as well, and... He's been referencing um, that movie a lot lately. His most recent one for his Ultrasun Randomized Nuzlocke was uh, about that as well, with the, the whole, like if you pull the wrong lever, I'm not gonna be able to do the scream that he did, but you, you basically, you pull the wrong lever and something horrible happens. And his, his scream on that was perfect. But, now I'm just kind of waiting for the game to end so I can see how we did. There we go. Thank you, Ruby. Did you take your love to town? Of course you get your pension on the first shot. I lost. I can already tell going in that I lost. I have all the money. But nothing else to my name. Because of course I didn't land any houses. My whole point on this was to collect property so I could unlock my next thingy. And I didn't get any of it. And I broke my own rule, and I got the love tokens anyway. But it was an alpaca. What was I gonna do? <sighs> See, Ruby, you should have paid your loan off. For cheap. Irresponsible. 
Look at that. See, now going the Scrooge route, I have to talk a little bit louder because, uh, lawnmowers. <laughs> going the Scrooge route got me third place. At least when I play the Joy way, I come in second. You know, I'm, I'm not last. I'm, I'm, I'm the first loser. Not the official loser, you know? That was horrible. So, I am going to play this again, and I am going to focus on me. Just like I did in the last time, because I need my collectibles. I didn't get a single collectible in this. I am 905 points. No, I'm not. Nine, yes, not 900 math. 905 points away from my car. I am so perturbed, but my plan for the next one, I was going to say next stream, this is not a stream, my next video of this, which I should probably do now since he's going to still be out there doing that, I can at least get started on it, I'm going to play the joy way and try to finally get these things unlocked. I know I'll unlock this one, but I'm not sure. I'm going to go for this one. I'm going to try to get the love tokens up and my other car unlocked. This one, not going to happen. I know me and houses, we do not get along. But I am going to give it a shot anyway. So, until next time, this has been the Scrooge edition of life to show exactly what happens when you go through life letting money and greed and selfishness rule you. You finish last. They say nice guys finish last? No. Greedy people finish last because all you need is love catch y'all later oh no <clears throat> because after all all you need is love so thank you guys so much for watching check out the links down below for my entire playlist of this my link to twitter and my discord server to become a loved one and i'll catch you guys very very soon